both may feel the same back in, <laughs> in, in a strange way. I got to the, the sense towards the end of the game, both decided a point's not bad, gets us something on the board, although both would have, would have loved it. Beto and Dan Juma, I thought, got better as the game went on as a pair. McBurney and, and, and Archer as a pair for Sheffield United looks like the threat. Archer looks like a real player at the top of the pitch. And it needed a brilliant moment from Jordan Pickford. The save almost doesn't look as good in slow motion. Mm. In live action, what he did in that sp short space of time was huge for Everton. Who sticks out for you after that game? Well, I, to answer the, the same question you, you asked earlier, I think, sadly, both teams will take the point and, and think they did, did enough. Um, Sheffield United showed me something today. Hammer, really good in the midfield. They now have a goal scorer um, in Cam Archer that looks lively. And McBurney, a little one-two punch. Okay, he doesn't bring a ton to the game, but he holds the ball up and brings people in. Not bad. Yeah, Gustavo Hammer's had a good start to the season. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.